I remember the day I turned 30. I had this kind of weird idea in my mind that <laughs> everything uh, wasn't hadn't fallen into place. Like, I didn't have a plan for when I was 30. But for some reason, when I turned 30, I felt really, really, really weird and slightly disappointed because just in myself, not in anyone else, not in anything else, just in myself. Suddenly, all these things popped out of nowhere. And it was like, you didn't do this, you didn't do that, you didn't do this, you didn't do that. And none of it really came from anywhere. It's just, just suddenly I was hit with this rush of everything. And it's weird, like I'm about to be 35 in a couple of weeks, March 18th. And I'm getting hit with that rush again, that wave that weirdness where I'm trying to suddenly figure out all these things that like at 35 you should have this and you should be doing this and you should be doing that and I mean the funny thing about it is like I have way more than I thought I'd ever have at 35 or in my life actually great home great family (sighs) good art career could be better but it's going pretty well I got a new Patreon. That's awesome. <laughs> this is actually, it's all going really, really well. I'm just, I guess I'm just nervous. It's silly, but uh, that's just kind of how it works out sometimes. You do all the things that you think you're going to do after you've already done all the things that you actually were doing. And it feels kind of nuts. It's that whole expectation. It's like when I paint. I make it a point. I make it a point when I make something to just make it. I don't stop. I don't look back. I just do it. And then when it's done, I move on to the next painting. I'm kind of precise that way. I'm playful, but I'm precise with it. And I do that so that I don't spend all this time wasting Just going, well, if I make this, then I got to do this. And what if people don't like it and all these other things. And I mean, all that stuff is there. But I'm refusing to let it be who I am or what I am or how I make. Because that's silly. I don't need that. I'm good. (laughs) And that's how it feels when you, for me, turning 35. I realize I'm making a lot of things and I'm doing things. And although I'm not making everything every 45 minutes and I'm not painting every, I'm not painting three paintings a day or, you know, a painting a day or anything like that. My paintings are so much more rich and vibrant and alive. My skills, somewhere that I never imagined my skill would be at 18. And it's 35 to 18. Like that's a whole life for some people. Some of my fans are, are that age, are the interbetween age of that, of the two ages. And that's, that's crazy. That's surreal. I hope that when I make things, it, it touches you in good spots. And it brings you all those things that make you feel good and happy. That's what I want for my birthday. Good things. Side note, guys. Uh, just so I don't forget, I'm on Patreon. Uh, come and check me out. It's a pretty cool plot. I've got lots of cool prizes and lots of cool stuff that I'm doing, as well as I let you know my kind of creative process. Uh, every little bit helps. For instance, I have a $1, a $5, a $10, a $20 a month uh, Patreon. Um, like I said, I share pretty much everything with all my people. Uh, there's lots of little gifts and stuff that I'll send in to you. Just uh, every little bit helps, you know. Thank you. Paint her out.